Whose business is our wrongdoing? Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. Are you the kind of person who is self-confident and whose conscience does not accuse him or her? Or are you the person who is sensitive and accusing oneself the unconscious is accusing us of a lot of wrongdoing and evil and being bad. We know that God wants the best for us. He wants us to have a joyful life here on earth and he also wants to bring us into his eternal kingdom, into heaven where there is joy and everlasting love and help each other. By contrast, the devil wants to torment and to torture us already in this life and also in eternity in hell. And he has two strategies. Either he lets us be too self-confident that we think we do not need the love of God, we do not need his forgiveness, we do not need his help, but in fact we do need him. Or he tries to accuse us too much and trying to condemn us, that we condemn ourselves, and again we do not look at the love of God. Again we would not trust in his mercy and his forgiveness. But what? it is not his business. The devil is not allowed to condemn and to accuse us because he is worse than we are. It is not his business that we have sinned, that we have done wrong, because we have not sinned against him. What we do wrong? We trespass the commandments of God and not of the devil. In Psalm 51, it says, <clears throat> Psalm 51 verse 4, I have sinned against you, only against you, and done what you consider evil. And from the verse 1 on, he is praying, the psalmist is praying to the Lord, Be merciful to me, O God, because of your constant love, because of your great mercy, wipe away my sins. That is the right attitude to know that we have done wrong and yet to come to God, to trust in his mercy. Wash away all my evil and make me clean from my sins. I recognize my faults. I'm always conscious of my sins. I have sinned against you, only against you, and do what you consider evil. So you are right in judging me. I have been evil from the day I was born. Remove my sin and I will be clean. Wash me and I will be whiter than snow. Create a pure heart in me, O God, and put a new and loyal spirit in me. The Lord is merciful. He wants the best for us. He wants us to have a life filled with joy here and also in eternity. That is why we do not need to be condemned, even though we would deserve it. Lord, we thank you for your love and you for your mercy. Help us to look at you, at your love, at your mercy, at your forgiveness. Help us not to look at ourselves and to be to trust in ourselves, nor let us be condemned and accused, but help us to look at you alone, at your mercy, at your forgiveness, and at your power, you are almighty. We pray that you guide us through this life towards your eternal kingdom, where we praise your holy name and your mercy and love forever. Amen. <laughs>